Last time on Total Drama Redemption Island, Joe got Tyler into the Alliance for the sole purpose of getting rid of B. Pierdo contemplated getting rid of Eva. Justin had a heartwarming welcome back party with Sammy. And in the challenge, despite an early lead, Joe pointing out that Tyler's shoes were on the wrong feet awakened Tyler's hidden potential, and he was able to beat Axel for a win for his team. Despite Justin being ready for Boney Island, Wayne saved Sammy. And despite Pierdo seemingly getting Justin and Brick to vote off Eva, Brick stayed true to his original alliance, and as a result, Justin was voted off. Brick goes to Eva and tells her that Bierdo tried to betray her, and Axel says that it's a likely story, traitor. Brick says he's sorry for that, he was tricked by Justin to do it, but he doesn't have a lying bone in his body. Eva says that if he wants to keep the bones he has in one piece, then he should leave. Brick in confessional says he really messed up. He should have just been loyal from the start. Beardo goes to Brick and he says that that was a stupid move for him to do. Merge is coming soon, and Eva and Axel are gonna team up in every challenge. Brick asks if they can team up, and Beardo asks why, so you can betray me too? No thanks, I'm good. Face it, you're not nearly as loyal as you say you are. Beardo in confessional says that emotional manipulation is the best way to manipulate someone. Brick is gonna be second guessing himself for days. Sammy tells Brick that if it makes him feel any better, she's on the outs as well and she won't let him be voted off by her original group. Tyler and Joe are racing against each other and Joe says that she wins again, but he's actually not that far off. Tyler says that he can't believe the difference this has made for him. He hasn't slipped or tripped in an entire week. Tyler in confessional says that it's like Joe flipped a switch in her brain or something. She's so much cooler and nicer than before. Joe in confessional says, what, did you think I was here to talk about how I was going to betray Tyler? Nah, he's actually worth a damn now. Honestly, I kinda wanna drag him to the finals for a fun finale. Only kinda. Joe says that on the down low, she's worried about B. Tyler asks what she means, and Joe says that B has more brains than all of us combined. Which Tyler responds by saying, I know, right? He's pretty valuable. Joe says that he's not getting it. What about Merge? I know you haven't been there, but trust me, the Brainiacs are the worst. I was beaten by one after all. Raj and Wayne are going through an obstacle course B built, and Tyler says in confessional that Raj and Wayne would be crushed if B was gone, but it's not like he'd want Joe gone or one of the hockey bros gone either. Man, this is tough. Chris welcomes everyone to the challenge. From this day forward, there are no more teams. Tyler in confessional says that he finally made it to merge. This is all he wanted, besides a win of course. Joe in confessional says that this was expected after her all-star run. Raj says in confessional that they have perfect records now, and Wayne says that that's because they have the power of friendship. B just gives a smug grin in confessional. Axel says in confessional, whatever, this is just when the game gets serious. Eva says in confessional that after five seasons, this was well earned. Beardo in confessional says that he went from a first boot to a potential winner. This is his game to lose. Sammy in confessional says that she really doesn't know where she stands with everyone here. She hopes her group will stay together and take her back. And finally, Brick says that he should feel more at ease by this knowledge, but honestly, this worries him because now he has to be at every vote. Chris then tells him that someone's merge will be bittersweet, as this challenge will test their balance and endurance. Everyone must stand on thin pillars and stay up there for as long as possible. If you fall, you will be eliminated from the competition. No vote, no passing go, no getting a million dollars. Tyler says in confessional that this is his challenge to win. As they all are standing on the thin pillar, Brick says that in merge, they're gonna need him, and Eva says that they will take their chances before going with him again. Brick asks Joe if he can join her, and Joe asks if the cadet is asking for help and Brick says he's desperate. Sammy tells her to consider it and Joe rolls her eyes and says fine, I'll consider it. B is having a tough time due to his weight and Raj tells him to focus, it'll be okay. Bierdo whispers in B's ear. Sammy in confessional says that she doesn't trust Bierdo, he's different, but she doesn't know how yet and it's not just that he doesn't make a ton of obnoxious noises anymore. Wayne says that this is a piece of cake for him and Raji. His teachers used to make them both wear dunce hats and stand in the room for hours at a time. Axel says that one of them better fall or else she will make them fall. B wipes his forehead and Raj tells him that it'll be okay, just stay up a little longer. It looks like someone else is getting tired. Beardo looks at B and shoves Raj off his platform and Wayne yells out to Raj before jumping in after him. Chris says that Raj is out and he is also eliminated. Tyler asks why he would do that and B shrugs his shoulders and Beardo says it must have been an accident. Raj tells Wayne sorry for ruining his chance at winning and Wayne says that's nonsense. He needed to make sure he was okay. Chris says that this is heartwarming, but Raj has a boat to get onto. Wayne hugs Raj and Raj gives a snow owl goodbye before leaving. Chris tells him that today's not over though, it's time to find our winner. 
they will be the only person to go to the spa hotel. B falls in finally. Chris then brings out a pizza and says that whoever jumps in will get this. Tyler jumps in after it, saying that with no elimination on the island tonight, pizza is as good as it gets. Tyler asks Wayne if he wants some, pizza is no good without a friend, and Wayne tells him thanks. The next offering is ice cream and Sammy dives in. She ends up sharing it with Tyler and Wayne. The next option offered is a surprise. Bierdo raises an eyebrow and jumps in and he goes to get it. In confessional, Bierdo says he can definitely work with what he got. Brick says that he's not giving up and then $5,000 is brought out and Joe jumps in saying it's all hers. Axel looks at Eva and says that she still has to pay her back for giving her immunity the last time and she jumps before kicking Brick off the platform and falling in herself. Chris says that Eva wins and she can choose someone to bring into the hotel. Before Eva can say Axel's name, Axel says that she knows she was going to pick her but she needs to find the idol. Eva says that they can relax for one night at least, but Axel says that they are at risk at merge. They need to help each other. Eva sighs and says she wants Joe. Joe in confessional says that she gets a week at the spa and $5,000. This week is her week. Chris then asks who she wants to send to Boney Island and Eva says she wants Axel to go. Chris says that usually they would share the spa with her girlfriend, but you two do things differently. He likes that. And that's all for tonight. Enjoy your safety and celebrate merch together. Next week, the backstabbing truly begins. And that's that for Total Drama Redemption Island Episode 10. What did you think? Question of the week, who's the alliance you would want to join at this merge? Axel and Eva, Beardo and B, Brick and Sammy, or Tyler and Joe? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below, and I'll see you all next time on Total Drama Redemption Island.